crazy pixel. Back in the 1980s, Japanese developer Data East clearly had a passion for burgers as they decided to create a game focused on a chef's ultimate battle to make these delicious sandwiches. The 1982 arcade game Burger Time was that game, and now it's back and better than ever thanks to a remake from developer G-Mode. Similar to the original, Burger Time Party is centered around Peter Pepper, a master burger chef who has the hottest grill in town. Yet, as many chefs know, cooking doesn't always go as planned, which is what happens with Peter when he's tasked with inventing a brand new burger. The ingredients that got chopped from Peter's latest burger recipe end up coming to life and become food foes. Because of this, Burger Time Party is an ultimate battle of man versus food. Obviously, the premise is silly and isn't supposed to be thought-provoking by any means. There isn't a story to go through here, and to be honest, I wasn't really expecting for there to be one. The whole zany start of Burger Time Party carries over to its bite-sized puzzle gameplay in which you need to serve up the best burgers in town. Rather than just making them on a grill, you have to walk over the ingredients so that they can stack together to form a delicious burger. With food foes coming out of trash cans and chasing players around to stop burgers from being made, making burgers isn't so easy in Burger Time Party. All the foes may just chase you, but each foe actually has a a different method of doing so. For instance, Mr. Pickle runs around randomly making it hard to gauge where he'll end up. You lose a life if they touch you, but you can temporarily stop them by dropping ingredients on them or stun them by spraying them with black pepper, or you can unleash a power-up on them. What Burger Time Party does well is balancing simplicity with complexity so that anyone of any age that plays the game can have a fun time. For those that simply want to make burgers, they can do just that without a care in the world, but others who are actually seeking a challenge can test their burger making skills by trying to reach the highest score possible. With hazards that also come up, the game can get pretty frantic, but that's what makes it fun. Alongside the single player mode offerings, there are also local multiplayer modes in Burger Time Party that make it a party game for you and your fellow burger loving buds to play. My friends and I happen to enjoy the main burger mode the most since it was far more hectic, all around challenging, and had various power ups right from the start. In the mode, it was a matter of everyone I was playing with to be on the same page, or else we'd fail in our burger making mission. The other multiplayer offering, Battle Burger, was fun initially, especially given that it actually lets you control one of the food foes, but it quickly got stale. It basically boils down to being a quick game of cat and mouse. There just really isn't that much going on in the mode to keep it fresh. I was a little bummed out to find that there wasn't an option to add bots, and also that the game doesn't have any online multiplayer options. What was a pleasant surprise though was the vibrant and old school cartoon art style in Burger Time Party. It fits the game well, and the upbeat soundtrack further captures the whole retro cartoon vibe of the game. While it isn't a revolutionary party game by any means, Burger Time Party is a deliciously simple yet fun arcade game that anyone can enjoy. That said, the game is best played in short bursts as it loses its flavor pretty quickly. Noise Pixel is giving Burger Time Party a 7 out of 10. Thanks for watching. You can read our full review at noisepixel.net. Noise Pixel is run by a group of gamers who work hard to deliver news, reviews, previews, and more. Please subscribe to keep up with all of our future content.